Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, a little story I came up with, I'll just sing it to you, make it a little bit of a tell song. A song tell about a man named Warren. Big old regular goober bumpkin. Big time goober bumpkin. Full fledged idiot. Born without a brain stem. Born without frontal lobes. You don't care. You're a goober. You got no use for that. You economize. One day the big old goober decided to leave his goober mansion. Maison de Goober. Put it in French style. Goober don't speak French. Goober barely speak English. Goober just grunts. Big old idiot grunting Goober. A bumpkin. A bumpkin grunts. So the big old idiot Goober decides to leave his maison. Go for a little bit of an exploration. He wanders, he trundles, trundles all the way across, across the railroad tracks. But he trundled, he trundled, he trundled across town, trundled across the village, trundled through the city, trundled. Made it all the way to the next state, to a sleepy little village, a sleepy little village. There's a politician in town, big old Washingtonian fat cat. He was up there on a podium, staging himself a rally. All sorts of things. He was saying he was going to cut taxes. He was going to get them more benefits. He was going to get them more taxes. He was going to cut the benefits. He don't care. He a politician. He'll say whatever it takes to get himself reelected. Just got to tell the people what he thinks the people want to hear. What choice do they have? People. They're small. They're little ants. He's a big old Washingtonian fat cat. So he's telling them about the babies he kissed. He's telling them about the saying all sorts of idiot shit. People eating it up. They know he's full of shit, but maybe this time around he'll be different. He's up there on that podium, up there on that stage, up there at that rally. He's telling them all sorts of shit. Shoveling them all sorts of bullshit lies. Cause that's what a Washingtonian fat cat's gotta do to get reelected. Anyway, the trundling goober, trundling bumble, bumbling trumble goober bumpkin, Maury, gets to town. He looks up there at that stage and he sees that Washingtonian fat cat and he thinks to himself, Boom. Finally, finally at the end of the rally, he politician Washingtonian fat cat, he says, So, uh, let's 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 take some questions. Let's take some questions from the audience, because the audience got questions and I'm a man of the people, and when the people got questions, I'm the man who wants to answer them. So I'm a man with a plan. And almost on instinct, Goober, Goober shot himself up out of the seat. All eyes are on the goober now as he trundles up to that podium, trundles up to that stage, to the microphone. The politician don't want to make no scene. I'm sure the guy may look like a goober. He may be an important townsman. He may be the barber. He may even be the mayor. So so the politician, the politician kind of waves his handlers back, his handlers getting ready to throw the goober off the stage. He ain't supposed to come up on stage, he's just supposed to shout his questions. Politician can, can pretend not to hear them if they're awkward questions, but but Goober almost trips as he climbs up the stairs. It requires requires all of his all of his all of his brain power and he don't got no brain stem. He just operates on the go. And right now the go is telling them to went. The location for the went happens to be up near that shiny microphone. The Goober, Goober standing too close to the politician to watch plenty of fat cat. He's kind of looking him straight in the eye. An unblinking stare, kind of awkward, kind of creepy, kind of fearless. The hush falls over the rally. Big time hush falling over the big time political rally. Something important's about to happen, everyone can feel it, everyone can feel it in their bones, they can see it in their eyes, they can feel it in their eyes and see it through their bones. And the goober leans towards the mic, still looking at the politician. The goober says, you like my little echoing?